everybody. Today I'm wearing my new pajama. It's it says join the club and I'm really happy you to join me. Read this book here and it's called Amelia Bedelia Chalks One Up by Harmon Parrish. Amelia Bedelia chalks one up. Amelia Bedelia's mother was a, as glum as the weather. Where is the sun? She asked. I am really blue. Amelia Bedelia looked at her mother. She was not blue. She was not even wearing anything blue. She was not wearing a smile smile either either great well, I skipped one I I am having a play date said Amelia Bedelia maybe you should have one too great idea sweetie said Amelia Bedelia's mother mom she made two short calls phone calls. Then she said, I am going to town. After I go shopping, I will meet Dad for coffee. Mrs. Adams will watch you and Rose. Have fun, said Mrs. Adams, who was their next door neighbor. Neighbor? 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 Don't worry about us, girls. We will have a, a ball. Amelia Bedelia, Bedelia's mom, mother waved goodbye. Well, chalk up another great day, she said, as Amelia Bedelia waved back. She got an even better idea. Amelia Bedelia found her big bucket of chalk in the garage when rose fa when rose's father dropped rose off amelia bedelia was already hard at work wow said rose you have every color in the rainbow i need them said amelia bedelia i'm chalking up a great day to make my, my mom happy. Want to help? Sure, said Rose. To warm up their drawing arms, Amelia Bedelia and Rose drew squares for hopscotch on the sidewalk. When they played the game, Mrs. Adams was amazing. Chip walked Chip Chip walked by with his big brother and their puppy scout. What is going on? yelled Chip. We're chalk chalk chalking up a great day, said Amelia Bedelia. Want to help? Cool, said Chip. What makes your mom happy? asked Rose. She likes flowers and green things, said Amelia Bedelia, pointing to where plants grew last year. Rose got green, red, and pink chalk. Chalk. She began chalk. She began drawing roses on Amelia Bedelia's house. Hey, Amelia Bedelia. Daisy was walking by with her babysitter and her baby sister. What are you doing? she asked. Choking up a gray day, said Amelia Bedelia. Want to help? Yes, said Daisy. Daisy began drawing daisies. 
That's my mom's favorite flower," said Amelia Bidella. "She will love those. Thanks." Amelia Bidella told her friends about her mom's favorite spots. Chip drew a map. Amelia Bidella, Rose, and Daisy added shops and places to eat. Mrs. Adams made tasty treats, tasty treats for everyone. What great drawings! She said. Roll out the red carpet for your mom. Amelia Bedelia didn't have one, so they drew her, her mom, a carpet leading to a, to the best surprise of all. Then Amelia Bedelia saw their car pulling into the driveway. Her parents had come home together. Hi, Mom," said Amelia Bidella. "Welcome back." You guys really went to town," said Amelia Bidella's father. "Not us," said Amelia Bidella. "Mom went to town. We stayed home and drew." Amelia Bidella's parents followed the red carpet. Everyone else. Followed them. A yellow sun plus a blue moon makes green," said Amelia Bedelia. "And green makes you happy." Amelia Bedelia's Bedelia's mother was speechless. She hugged each of them. She hugged Amelia Bedelia the longest of all. Amelia Bedelia's dad took more photographs. It was a good thing he, he did. It rained all night long. The chalk, the chalk, washed away, and the pictures melted. All the colors of the rainbow soaked into the earth. The next day was bright and sunny. Amelia Bedelia and her mother, mom, stood at the window, feeling yellow and pink and green and every other color except blue. The end. So I hope you like this story. It's a nice story, right? It's a beautiful story. It's like my other books that is called Beat the Cat. And and please like and subscribe and click that little bell over there. And I I see you next time. Bye.